I buy matching sets from the Amazon and the Target in the Nordstrom. Everything gotta match or it's gotta be a one piece because I start putting stuff together and I start going auntie real fast. Listen long, long enough, you can love me. Good evening. Girl, it's late. What, what time is it? Let me get my phone. So I just finished filming for this unit. Mm -hmm. So I did another V part wig and I think it's cute. Cute, cute, cute. I was debating on doing another V part wig, but I ended up doing this one. I'm in love with that Christmas tree. It's, it's still up, girl. I don't know what you tell me. Want me to want me to do so? Um, it is 12 09 p.m. on January 12th. Technically, it's, it's January 11th. I have to get unready, take off all of this makeup and this hair, but I don't quite feel like it right now. I like the look now. I get to get unready and relax so. Tomorrow, I have a uh, orthodontist appointment at Kaplan Orthodontics. That's where I go for my teeth. Um, so they'll be looking at my teeth and stuff. I don't even feel like taking off this wig because it's cute. Like this is cute. I still, obviously, as you can tell, I still don't have a voice, but last night was the first night since December, 28th that I've had a full night's sleep without waking up, without coughing, none of that. And what I did was before I went to sleep, if you have like coughing and stuff like that, that nasal rinse changed my life, girl. So before I go to bed, I use this Neomed sinus rinse with a saline packet with bottled water. I put it in here. Why is it so dark? And I rinse my nose at night and I feel like I have a post nasal drip that has me coughing like crazy in the morning at night when I'm sleeping. So I'll wake up coughing so much that I start like shaking. I do this at night with this rinse, clears it out. So I'm supposed to do it twice a day. So I don't cough throughout the day. I forgot to do it this morning. But once I did that, I slept all through the night. We also sleep with a humidifier, but we use this humidifier from, what brand is this? Oh, it's a Honeywell. It's a Honeywell humidifier. Yeah, we got this and we use this at night. It helps us to sleep better and the skin, baby, your skin is so much better. But um, yeah, I use this and I was able to sleep through the nights for the first time in like 10 days. I, my sleeping has been horrible so i'm running my mouth i need to get unready but let's go ahead and take off the wig this wig is an amazing wig i love this wig like the curls on it get out of here get out of town we need better lighting in these bathrooms so i'm just gonna take this off pop this off and because i have on makeup i'm gonna be jumping in the shower just to get oh all of this off girl it's giving antenna girl i like to braid my hair down usually i'll do one big braid but i guess i'll do two tonight i'm gonna braid my hair down take a shower and then i'll see y'all tomorrow before we head to kaplan orthodontics go ahead and get my follow-up and lashes, I use magnetic lashes. Blue, blue. They got magnets on it. Magnets off. Jump in the shower, get all of this drag off, and then in bed we go. I see y'all soon. Gross late at night. It's midnight. Y'all know I'm trying to get thick, right? So I be eating as much as I can, as close, because I have Invisalign, I can't snack. So I have to take my Invisalign out before I eat or keep it out a little bit longer after I eat to have a snack. This right here, girl, these Sun Poppers. I mean, to people that can eat chips, 
dairy and gluten. This may not be your judge, but this is good. I love the sour cream and onion, but I have the sun poppers in the Himalayan pink salt. My husband made a mistake and bought this one. I'm so happy he did because it's so good. It tastes like regular chips to me. Y'all don't try it and say that it don't taste like regular chips and be mad at me, but it's really good. I think it's low calorie, but it also has higher protein. There's protein powder in, this, in these chips. They're good. I'm waiting for my husband to get out the shower so I can get in. We have two bathrooms, but girl, the hot water don't be hitting in here. I'm waiting for him to get out so I can get in and run all the hot water out the house. I'm just sitting here eating chips. What y'all doing? With this baby hair and these lips that grow, I'm a mess. Anyway, I said I was gonna see y'all tomorrow. I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow, all right. Good morning. What is it morning? Good morning. It's no, it's 11.58. Well, I told y'all yesterday that I had an orthodontist appointment today at Kaplan Orthodontics to get a follow-up on my um, Invisalign. <clears throat> so, we're headed there now. My appointment's at 12.05. So I think we're gonna get there a little bit early. Hopefully it's not gonna be a long appointment because I'm tired. Oh, it's, where is it? Oh, right there. I'll see you guys inside. I, I told you I'm gonna do a whole full review of my um, Invisalign experience. So I'll probably see you guys inside, but you'll see the full footage of you know this follow up i don't know if they're gonna give me new trays if there's gonna be adjustments i hope not i hope this is the end of my treatment i only have three more trays so yeah we're about to head inside and i'll see you inside back home after my orthodontic appointment my teeth they said they are looking good I think a couple one of my teeth is like leaning in I'm not sure which one it is but he said they're moving fine I'll have to go back in February to get um, more aligners I think also I think I have I have to go to my dentist and get a cleaning and they have to look at my teeth and we'll have to talk about bonding on my teeth because these teeth right here are really small. So I have to pay to get my teeth bonded as well. But my teeth look good. So excited about that. So now I need to go ahead and upload a video. We do have a video that my first wig review video of the year. Finally, I'm gonna boil up some sweet potatoes so we can have uh, some, so I can have a different, something different for lunch. I'm really tired. Come on, <laughs> come with me. So I bought these sweet potatoes like a few days ago. I haven't boiled them. I don't, I think you're supposed to boil sweet potatoes for like 40 or 50 minutes. I'm trying to figure out if I should skin them. So I'm gonna make lunch. I was trying to figure out what I was gonna make with these sweet potatoes. I didn't think it through, but I think I'm gonna do like a sweet potato, baked potato with vegan meat, but I don't know how I want the meat to taste. Like, would it be good with tomato sauce? Mm -hmm. No, uh, with sweet potatoes? No. The palate, so maybe possibly. I would do a palate. Anybody eats Beyond Meat? <laughs> I think a sweet potato, baked potato would be good. So I have my Beyond Meat. Y'all know this is a, I'm gonna use the Beyond Beef meat and I think I'm just gonna put the crumbles on top. What'd you say? I don't know. <laughs> meat? I think it should be fine. Seasoned crumbles. Y'all know I can't cook, so I don't know. We're just gonna do that.
finished making it. I'm gonna try it. Girl, I don't know what I was doing. Vegan cheese, a sweet potato, and vegan meat. I don't know. I'm gonna use a spoon. Y'all, I can't cook, so please don't talk about me. I could have done without the cheese. But this is good. It's like a salty sweet. I love salty sweet. The cheese wasn't necessary. I don't like it. It's good. Y'all may not think it's good, but it's good. Hey, look, hey, um, bread it up like sandwich. Are you okay? Working on. I'm back home. So, I went to the gym and I did a little workout trying to get. You know, I'm trying to get my weight back up because my weight, you know, she dropped a little bit. You know, I'm happy wherever I am, but I just prefer, you know, a little thickness. I'm going to go ahead and eat some lunch. It is late. If y'all don't know, we eat lunch late in this household. It's 639. And I think I'm going to have that sweet potato dish. I, I did too much with that sweet potato dish. I don't know what I was thinking. It was good, but it was good because I was hungry. Y'all know I can't cook, so don't talk about me. So I need to figure out what I'm gonna eat. I may just have some vegan meat and some rice because it's easy, or I may do microwave up a sweet potato, but I kind of want to cook it in a skillet. But I need to eat something now because I need a post-workout protein. Let me figure something out. What I'm gonna eat? Y'all, I know my mama's watching this and laughing because my mama know I can cook. <laughs> Girl, this is what I ended up with. A sweet potato mash with vegan crumbles. That's not what I wanted. They got on cute, cause girl. No ma'am, no ma'am. We gonna try this little itty bitty sweet potato mash. Like what is going on? Hold on. It's good to me. Cause I like sweet and savory, but this not what I wanted. Y'all don't laugh at me. I can do some wigs, but this this ain't. <clears throat> I mean, it's a good post workout meal, I guess. I thought I was gonna have like some sweet potato cubes. No, no. I mean, okay. But right now, I'm gonna watch The Real Housewives of Orange County. Watch the girlies, because I love all the Real Housewives, if y'all don't know. Yeah, girl, let me get into watching this mess. I'm going to eat my mashed potatoes. <laughs> Good afternoon. It is, I think it's like, it's like 2.30. What's today? Today's Saturday, January 15th. Ooh, I remember the date. <clears throat> I have to look at my phone. My voice is slowly but surely coming back, but it's still giving that nasty mess, girl, so annoying. But this morning I had a wax appointment at Christian Michael Aesthetics. Wax appointment with Aaliyah Womack at Christian Michael Aesthetics. She is amazing. I always get a Brazilian sugar wax from her. I get it every month. She really does an amazing job like amazing i wish i could have taken y'all with me but i was running late so i didn't have time to bring my camera blah 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 anyway so right now i'm headed to target i need to pick up in trader joe's i gotta pick up some face wash i need to get some vitamins um i need to go get my snacks from whole foods so i have a couple things that i need to get there is supposed to be some sort of snowstorm that we're supposed to be having here in Atlanta girl I'm over it January February in Atlanta is the worst times if you don't like cold January February is just cold snow ice not snow but mostly ice like because Atlanta doesn't get a lot of snow but anyway um I'm gonna show y'all what I'm wearing can I show y'all from here y'all sitting on the couch I felt like wearing something tight because I felt cute today so I got these pants from Target. Girl, I just wanted to wear some tight. I don't even know if this outfit is cute, but I just wanted to wear some tight. 
So I want to change it to some sweatpants, but I'm sick of wearing sweatpants. I want to wear something like tight and cute. So I got this shirt from Amazon and these pants are from Target. Um, they're really comfortable. They're comfortable pants. I was wearing a black top with this, but it was giving Halloween. So I changed my mind on that. So I'm just gonna go to the store. It, when you live in Atlanta, you know that when it snows, it's a problem, okay? It's, it's a problem out here. So it's too cold for this top. It's all cropped and stuff. Let me, let me change it to this sweater. Do it actually like give? It don't, but like a girl, I gotta go. So <laughs> I want this to look like a host so bad, but this is all I could give that's warm. So I definitely need to go shopping for some more warm stuff, but this will work for now, I guess. Yep, y'all, my style is really, I don't like this either. <sighs> This really don't go, it don't go. I, it would look better with jeans. I changed my mind three times because I don't know how to dress. I don't know how to put stuff together. That's why I watch, I buy matching sets from the Amazon and the Target in the Nordstrom. Everything gotta match or it's gotta be a one piece because I start putting stuff together and I start going auntie real fast. This is what we going with. Matching set, it's super thick. This is from Amazon. I've never worn this before. It's brand new, so this is what we're wearing with some tennis shoes, okay? If y'all like me, please let me know. I worked in corporate America for so long that I stopped knowing what my style was. Oh, we got thumb holes. I don't know what my style is anymore. So I'm still, while I figured it out, I'm buying matching sets. Okay, y'all see? I'm looking fit Tiana. It's cute. My body looks good. It's kind of hoish. I like this. This is cute. We going with this and I need to go to the store. I need to hurry up and get up out of here. The girls are already in the streets ripping and running, looking for their stuff. I'm buying a few more of these sets because they have it in mul multiple colors. This is in olive, but I'm gonna get it in black. I'm gonna get it in everything because I ain't gotta worry about matching things together. Amazon fits. That's what we doing. back home after shopping and girl <laughs> I couldn't even really vlog in the store because the people are out here like it is Y2K they was out here like it was Y2K shopping the stores were full you couldn't you couldn't it, you just had to get in there and make space <clears throat> and get everything that you needed and get out I went to three stores and it was packed everywhere Whole Foods Trader Joe's and Target. And then my husband, we split the grocery store run. My husband went to Costco and Publix. But girl, it was a lot. It was a whole lot. But we got everything, a whole bunch of stuff. And now we're back home and we're about to make some pizzas. I'm gonna make a vegan, no, it's a lie. A no dairy, a dairy-free, gluten-free pizza. It ain't gonna be vegan because it's gonna have turkey sausage on it. And my husband's gonna have a gluten-free cheese meat sort of pizza, so. Peace wine time. My husband likes cold wine. I like room temperature wine. My teeth can't handle it. But see, I wear Invisalign, so I guess it doesn't matter.
if you're looking for like a, I don't think this is low calorie. If you're looking for a gluten-free cauliflower crust, we love this cauliflower crust. It's crispy. It just tastes like thin crust pizza. It's actually really good. It's dairy-free and gluten-free. There's also one from, I think it's like Green Giant, but we always get the cauliflower. So good. Let me grab our ingredients. A mild Italian turkey sausage. Shout out to the pepperoncinis. Pineapples. He's having turkey turkey pepperoni on his, and this is his sauce. You want chicken? Or you want that? And I like to do uh, pesto pizza. My little tummy can't take. My tummy can't take a. Um, actual tomato sauce it makes my stomach hurt acid reflux so i like to use this this pesto is pretty good and it's vegan pesto because most pesto has like dairy in it so we're using this pesto and my husband always makes pre-made chicken so we're just gonna shred some of that up it's gonna be real good so y'all go ahead and watch while we make these pieces and i'll see y'all when it's time to finished our pieces this is mine i know it looks crispy but it's really good that's his he's got pepperoni cheese pineapple the sweet and savory and a whole lot of pepperoncinis that's a lot of pepperoncinis so we're about to eat this vlog is over i guess i'll see y'all next week for next week's vlog um the piece is good it's good Mm. Hey, look, hey, um, bread it up.